Today, we are going to compare two popular cameras, the Canon 400D and Canon 40D. We are going to take a look at their features, who they are for, how they perform in various use cases, user experiences, and which one is the right one for you. Links to both of the cameras will be listed in the description below. Let's get started. The Canon 400D and the Canon 40D are two digital cameras that were officially introduced respectively in the 14th of October 2006 and the 24th of October 2007. Let's take a look at how their specs compare to each other. We tested both cameras to assess their performance in different scenarios. Let's take a closer look at our ratings for each of them. Here are our ratings for the Canon 400D. For portrait photography, we will give it a 6 out of 10 rating. For street photography, we will give it a 6 out of 10 rating. For sports photography, we will give it a 9 out of 10 rating. For day-to-day -day photography, we will give it a 7 out of 10 rating. For landscape photography, we will give it a 5 out of 10 rating. Here are our ratings for the Canon 40D. For portrait photography, we will give it a 6 out of 10 rating. For street photography, we will give it a 7 out of 10 rating. For sports photography, we will give it a 9 out of 10 rating. For day-to-day -day photography, we will give it a 7 out of 10 rating. For landscape photography, we will give it a 5 out of 10 rating. Next, we will take a look at some sample photos from the Canon 400D and the Canon 40D. Keep in mind that these photos have editing done to them, so the result from your camera might be different. Let's start with the sample photos. Here are some sample photos from the Canon 400D. And here are some sample photos from the Canon 40D. Next, let's take a look at what other users of these cameras have to say about them. Here's what people have to say about the Canon 400D. I've had my Canon XTI for a month and it has really improved my photography. The image quality and ergonomics are great and the battery life is impressive. However, the hand grip is too small for my large hand and some settings are hard to find in the menus. Overall, I'm very happy with this camera and look forward to using it for many years. I love my Canon XTI camera. The picture quality is outstanding and I rarely miss a shot. The camera is fast and versatile, and the battery life is great. The only downside is that it's bulky and not as easy to carry around as a point-and-shoot. I also recommend investing in the EF 50mm lens for amazing close-up shots. Overall, it's perfect for capturing priceless moments of my little ones. Here's what people have to say about the Canon 40D. I've been using the Canon 40D for 6 months, and I love it. It's a solid and rugged camera with plenty of shooting options and functions. The 3.0 LCD is lacking in color and resolution, but it's still a great value. I've taken it exploring in various conditions, and it's held up well. I recommend getting the Canon Speedlight 580X2 and a few can- I recently upgraded from my Rebel XT to the 40D and I'm really impressed. The 40D is slightly larger and heavier, but I quickly got used to it. The 6 frames per second speed is a huge improvement for capturing action shots, and the focus is much better. I can even use ISO 800 without too much noise, which was a problem with the Rebel. The thumb wheel is great for reviewing and deleting photos quickly, and I'm hoping the automatic sensor cleaning will keep dust off the sensor. The only thing I don't like is the on-off switch and the location, and the big screen gets nose and cheek prints on it. Overall, I'm really happy with my choice to upgrade. To conclude, here are our overall ratings for both of these cameras. Canon 400D we will give it an overall rating of 7 out of 10. Canon 40D, we will give it an overall rating of 7 out of 10. 